I'm sitting at my house and I get a picture. I call Aaron, I'm like, where is this? He's like, that's our neighborhood. And the kids were playing basketball right on First Street, right? And the abandoned, like a house was there just on a plot. I'm like, we need a park. Like we had a park. I came to a vigil and um, one of the kids had just got killed. That's when me and Larry had talked. I'm like, I need you. We need a park. We need a park. These kids have no outlet. They have nowhere to go, nothing to do, but hang on the corners. It hurt me, man. It hurt. It hurt because it's our kids. I lost my brother to these streets. <sighs> A lot of parents lost their kids way too young because they don't have anything to do. I'm not a Hall of Famer <laughs> by myself. I'm a park baby. My dad had me at the park. I got off the bus after leaving high school and I'm gonna tell you, we went to the park with boots on to play basketball, do everything. I'm a park baby, and we got many park babies. You know, we got a lot of kids, and they need outlets. You know, we need to know they're safe. We need this park, all of us, old and young. The kids are our future. They need an outlet. This is not just Ed Reed's park. This is our park. This is St. Road Park. So, I mean, this started back when I used to work at the community center right on in Preston Hollow, and I feel like we need a community center too. So the park ain't just it. There's more to come. All right? Love y'all.